All right, what is going on, 5-9 Gaming? Raiden here hosting this match, Radical versus ZVG. And as you can see here, we're at the Wheel of Fortune or Misfortune, depending on who gets some good units and who doesn't. But before we begin, Radical, ZVG, do you guys have any initial comments before we make your teams? Yeah, uh, I want total transparency. We've already recorded this like a week ago, and I got my beat by ZVG. Factual, but, factual. Yeah, I, I, it gave you a Vegeta family team. I, nobody's ever gonna see it. That's not seeing the light of day, dog. <laughs> but either way, <laughs> we're jumping in to redo this. I'm probably still gonna get my ass beat again, but as long as the, the tides can turn against ZVG, we might see a little resurgence. But I had to be honest, Please I already told, like, I told my chat when I was live streaming that I got bodied by you, so I can't just be like, no, that didn't happen. I was just kidding. <laughs> Oh, okay, there you go. You There's got? that full transparency. Talk, bro? That, that Zenkai boost in confidence. Do you have any comments, CVG, before we begin? Please don't let me get any trash units. Please, I'm just asking well, for that. There you have it, Wheel. Give him trash <laughs> units. Here we go. So, Brad, your first <laughs> unit is going to be... Huh? All right, let's see. If the wheel would spin... Uh. <laughs> Technical difficulties. Technical difficulties. Don't worry about it. There, there we you go. go, your first unit. There's a whole bunch of yellows there. What do we got? Your first unit is going to be Blue Pan. Ah, Blue Pan. Oh, Blue Pan. Wow, there you wow. go. <laughs> we're, uh, we're off to brilliant, a good... Brilliant hey, pickup. Hey, she's she's the little 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 warriors, Z power can... away from 14 stars. So luckily, it's LBR. I'm glad. <laughs> That's good. Maybe OG Sidestep work. God. Hey, man, she's underrated. Z yeah. tier right there. Oh, yeah. Second unit. Green kid Ooh, trunks oh, transform. Okay. That's actually that's okay. That's actually not bad. Good. That's that not bad. That's not actually bad. a pretty good pick. <laughs> he's really good. That's not that. bad at all. Well, okay, he's comparatively to blue panties, really good. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so unit number three, we're looking at. Yeah, hopefully we get that diverse on? set here. It looks like a purple. Uh, purple chilled. Oh, he's my oh, favorite dear. hybrid. So. Oh, there you go. I mean, if ZVG gets any super sands, at least he got. <laughs> At least you got somebody. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> There's a lot of green Super Saiyans in the game, so. Fourth unit is going to be, hopefully you get some sort of synergy here because everyone is just uh, running their own thing. Yeah, purple Super Saiyan 2, Gohan Zenkai. Ooh. Oh, that'd be really Ooh. good if I had more than Zenkai 1. Ooh. But he's still Ooh. better than all of them. Zenkai 1 is still good. He's take not it. bad. He got a little hybrid Saiyan synergy there. It's actually like really Fifth good, actually. Unit. All right, fifth unit. Let's see. Give him something. Like Give him baby Vegeta. Huh? Blue Debora. Debora. Oh, there he is. Nice, nice. The nice. infamous Debora is here. Uh, maybe Memes I want those green effect. cards. Maybe I want those green cards. First, we got Go Basil. Gita Blue Stopper. Now we got Debora. And your final unit. Hopefully someone that puts the whole package together here, or it could just be another meme unit. Depends on what the wheel feels like. Blue Slug. Mm. Blue Slug. Mm. Ooh, I haven't seen him in a wow. while, bro. It's been wow years now. Dude, watch wow. you get a bunch of reds, and I'm going to have to bring Slug, Deborah, and then that transforming trunks. <laughs> That's going to be hilarious. <laughs> All right, so there you go, Brad's uh, team. Now, ZVG, you ready for your team? Okay. Decent. Hey, I'm ready. So your first unit is going to be... Oh, it's already a green. Uh oh. Green first green, form okay, cell. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Let me check if I have him. Because oh. I'm pretty sure I do not have uh -oh. this man at all. Uh oh. Let me check. Okay, let me check. All right, let's see. I don't okay, know how starting you keep off playing after your account got yeeted. I don't know how you do it, man. <laughs> if my account got yeeted, YouTube, I'd it. be like, oh, man. Well, it looks like I'm never <laughs> touching Legends again. <laughs> okay, green cell. All right, let's see. Yeah, first form yeah, cell. I, oh, I do have him. You do Why? have him. There you go. Oh my god, I do have him. There you him. go. All right. Oh my goodness. Purple Gohan so likes okay. to see that. Your second okay. unit is going to be Purple Super Boo. Hey, some regen going mm. going around here. Hold on, I don't okay, have a yellow unit. You can't have him. <laughs> do you have Purple Super Boo? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. Uh, yeah, okay, wait, cool. dude. My main attack is oh green. Hold god. on. Okay, first, first <laughs> unit. Third third unit. So uh oh, good. looks like a red. A yellow? Oh, yellow Videl. Okay, good. Right. Bro, what the? What don't you remember oh the show when Videl God. and uh, Boo fought together? I think it's pretty good. It's gonna make it work. Bro. <laughs> oh, looks like your fourth unit is gonna be a blue, and it is Blue Bulma. Wow. Regen and female warriors. You better hope that he gets some of the twenty ones. Otherwise, Wait, this is gonna Bulma. be pretty. Uh, this is a big yikes. I don't have her. You don't have I don't her. Have oh. Blue Bulma. No, I don't. Well, yikes! Okay. Straight right, for your good. door, friend. Good. 
Thank you, thank you. Ooh, Green Mai. Green Mai. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you're running female <laughs> warriors. Forget Regen and chuck that out the window. Oh my goodness. All right, and it looks like your final unit. Come on. Better Actually, be a female fifth, warrior at this point. I mean, your whole team is pretty much female see. warrior uh, regen. Regen, regen, regen. Green Piccolo. Oh, thank God. Oh my, my goodness. Favorite OG unit. Green Piccolo. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All in all, though, I mean, in terms of I your need, team, it's not one like... More, one more unit. One more unit. What do you mean one more one unit? More. I don't have Blue Boomer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> your, final Boomer, unit. That's, that's a, your final unit. Your final unit. It's like a seven-star UI or something in these units. <laughs> uh, no, it's a Blue Gohan, the adult. Dragon Ball Super, okay, Tournament of Power. Oh, okay, I do have him. Okay. All right. A pretty, a pretty handy use of some green cards in your team, it looks like. So that's going <laughs> to be your exact, teams. Absolutely. Any quick Terrible. comments before we jump into your matches? Bradrick, this. That's I could all I'm going to say. My first. I, I my like first it, actually. So I've watched some of these matches. If you guys watched Nas versus Tom, and Nas got Spirit Bomb Goku out of the shop, and Tom had Super Saiyan 3 Goku. I will take this. This is fine. I have at least a somewhat chance. I don't mind this. Yeah, to be fair, it's not it's not swinging too hard on one person's side, so not too bad. Yeah, yeah. I'm still going to lose. But All yeah. right. All right, well then, we're going to jump in straight for the first match. All right, here we go. Match number one. Brad going up against ZVG with a unique set of teams here. We're looking at a little bit of region on ZVG's team. And on Brad's perspective, the one that we're watching here, we see Brad has a little bit of hybrid sands, a little bit of region. It's really up to him on where he wants to go. He has Dabura, which at least provides him some additional green cards. Super useful for Gohan in terms of catching people in the sidestep, getting that damage buff, and even the trunks. But it looks like Brad opts for the hybrid sand push which you can't really fault him for it half his team is hybrid sand so this is going to be super exciting just because neither team is more overwhelmingly dominant over the other it's a mishmash mashed potato of pretty much anything so here we go going straight for the blast card let's see what brad does here does he get him in the sidestep here no zvg showing some excellent patient here using super boo character we haven't seen since 2018 pretty much on everyone's milk carton at this point going straight for the gohan gohan casually beating up his own daughter this is going quite crazy super intense this gohan i mean his supportive capabilities are not going to be helping out either of these regen units, but I think ZVG's plan here is to take advantage of Gohan's abundance of green cards with this cell. Because as you may know, cell pretty much sucks the life out of you with the green card, gets himself a ton of vanish and blast cards. So he's uh, pretty annoying, but it looks like Brad is completely aware of this, sticking with his purple Gohan, tanking all that damage, using all the green cards to power himself up because he knows full hand once he gets one hit on one regen unit after all these green cards, they're pretty much going to get Hadouken to no existence. So here we go. Ooh, in the sidestep, Boo is probably going to get mushed right here. Going to look like a piece of bubblegum on the side of the road. Oh, and he still lived. Oh, there we go. The green card right there. Just what we thought. But Gohan being completely, Im completely immune to the green card, pretty much saying, nope, I don't have to deal with that whatsoever. And if you're wondering why on earth is it only me that you're hearing? Well, guess what? I am the only one hosting this match here. I am the host with the most giving the full commentary. Speaking of full commentary, Looks like Pan did not care about that damage whatsoever, even though her costs are a little bit too high right now. It looks like it's pretty much neck and neck between Brad and ZVG right now. Both teams being so wacky and weird that no one's really able to capitalize on getting priority in terms of doing some overwhelming damage. I mean, this Boo, not the most dominant when it comes to dealing damage, but a lot of his damage comes from the fact that he gives so many debuffs. And Gohan, being Zenkai 1, doesn't care about any of these debuffs, as we saw with the green card. Brad going for the super ambitious strike card, going straight full, but ZVG trying to leverage all these stop time events in order to try to get him in the sidestep, but that's not working out here for Brad. Brad forgetting that Gohan goes ahead and locks all those strike cards when you swap out, and now Cell is going to be the most annoying bug you've ever seen, and pretty much, oh, the rising rush. I completely forgot about the rising rush. ZVG saving it for one of Brad's most intimidating units, being this green trunks just because he probably was just worried about him being the most modern unit on Brad's team. And at this rate, as you may know with the rules, the, the opponent, rather the person getting hit by the Rising Rush, has to go blue card, guarantee the hit here. I don't know what Brad's going to do. Brad does have potential to win this right here. ZVG completely forgot that Gohan, when his HP is 50% or below, once you hit him once, I'm pretty sure he gets an overwhelming amount of damage boost here. 
So Brad really has to take advantage of this rising rush, try to get the blue Gohan out of the way. The other two units he can definitely handle. Type advantage on the green cell, and I mean, Bubblegum Super Blue is not going to do any damage whatsoever. So if Brad could be careful here, he could turn this around for sure. CVG going ahead and using that green card there. I would have wished he hold it, held onto it for a different moment, but oh, Gohan holding on the purple one, not the blue one. Ah, that's game. Okay. CVG taking this first match. Big yikes, bro. Oof. Big yikes. All right, Phew. gentlemen, welcome back. I noticed that everyone's team was so wacky, so mishmash, so such a strange concoction of random units that when any one of you guys had priority, it was very hard to deal that overwhelming damage. I noticed that some of you had a ton of green cards too, and you didn't know what to do with it. Brad, in your case, how do you think you went? How do you think it went? I was gonna get. I thought I was gonna nearly get a kill with that ultimate after the two green cards. I thought I so like, too. Yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm gonna get I, this guy. I, I, thought, I thought I was gonna die. Fifty percent. I, I was it's like, over. <laughs> you know what <laughs> stinks though? The only reason why that didn't get that finishing kill is you were missing the second Zenkai passive. If you had that yeah. one, you would have blown his head right off. It's being Z one. Yeah. If, <laughs> if I had been even Z three, that would have just popped himself yeah, that would have taken his head clean off and for you zvg a lot of your units had a lot of green cards the gohan the first form cell did you find it any difficult trying to get rid of those green cards or did you have no, no issues no it was a particular difficult the thing was i was trying to set up i was trying to use super boo's green card on his gohan and then just rise and rush in. and then he was immune i was like what? yes I, that definitely <laughs> caught you off guard. We saw the panic, yeah, and by good. we, I mean just me, because I'm the only one commentating, but I saw the panic in your eyes when that yeah. happened. Yeah, I, did. I was like, dude. Well, that was a good match, was, though, so GG. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, that was a great match. It was the first, it was the first time using my um, first form cell, so it was a pretty good experience. There you go. All right, well, with that, then, we're going to wrap up the first match, and gentlemen, we're going to move on to the second match. All right, <sighs> let's go. Let's roll our teams. What was EVG? Not, not that team. I mean, Brad, not that team. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit better. Just a little bit better. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a little bit better there. Ooh. Just a little bit, though. All right, and here we go. Jumping in for match number two. Remember when I said mishmash, mashed potato teams? Well, it looks like everyone's coming in for second servings because once again, ZVG's team makes no sense. Brad's team, a little bit more some sort of semblance of a female warriors team kid gohan not understanding what he's doing there scouter vegeta maybe just trying to be with his wife i don't really know but they could sort of make it work zvg's team definitely on a more technical level could probably do some crazy work as you may know kid boo deborah ella frieza i mean if he can really put in work with the green and blue cards he could take this one for sure brad's team having the additional synergy having some max hp buffers aka green mai Kale disrupting combos. Maybe Brad can take this one out. We're going to see right here. Brad starting out with the green, green Bulma. With the blue Bulma having some sort of type of advantage over Kid Buu. Good old Kale coming here destroying two cards. She definitely could use a Zenkai Awakening for female warriors. As you may know, disruption is number one. Ella Freeze over here having such good supportive capabilities that it doesn't matter what team you throw him on. He's probably going to help him out quite a bit here. But Frieza once again proving his Platinum equipment has definitely made him a little bit more tanky. Brad going ahead and doing all the damage that he possibly can. And Frieza pretty much saying that that did no damage to me. What are you doing? Brushing off his shoulder here. Now here we go. Brad getting... Oh my god, I'm getting confused with everybody's name. CVG getting priority. And there's the green cards that I was talking about. Locking in his opponents. Reducing the sub counts. Not caring about uh, side the cover rescue stuff here. Dropping combos. High technical play here. We're seeing some crazy work. Can Brad make him pay this all off with dividends? Oh, ZVG catching him with the tackle there. Going ahead and using a strike card instead. Balma, just from tap attacks alone, pretty much dying, just like it would if it was in a real Dragon Ball session right there. She would absolutely get her head knocked off for one tap attack from Jiren. Kid Buu over here. Remember, Kid Buu heals, what, 3% of his uh, HP for each one of his strike cards? So I guess ZVG is saying, well, Bubblegum Boy, you are pretty much the bullet sponge for this one here. Take the hits, heal it off a little bit. I don't really care. Brad coming in with Kale to disrupt the cards, but forgetting that, Kid Boo and his ultimate at this point at 155, man. This is, uh, I don't know if this is going to kill Bulma, but it's definitely going to do quite a bit of damage. I don't believe Kid Boo's ultimate is the AoE. It's going to be his blue card that's AoE. 
Oh, catching him in the sidestep. Everyone doing big brain plays, super dangerous plays here. Can Brad kill Frieza? I, yes, there we go. If you ask me, that was the right choice. Getting rid of Frieza gets rid of that crazy key recovery and damage inflicted passive. Taking away that support capability will definitely make Jiren and Kid Buu both look a little bit more squishy. So definitely looking like Brad might be taking this one here. Getting rid of those supportive capabilities is a pretty big deal, especially with him having, oh, Brad catching him in the sidestep. Kid Buu surprisingly tanky. I'm, I'm actually quite surprised that uh, Blue Bulma didn't do that much damage. Oh, Rising Rush on the Scatter Vegeta. Understandably so, considering Scatter Vegeta is Zenkai 5. So in terms of Brad's most intimidating, oh, guessing his Rising Rush though. Brad may have forgotten the rules here. He is supposed to go blue card to guarantee that Rising Rush being successful. So he's going to stand there and take a little bit of a beating here. No issue at all. I would have preferred if ZVG didn't use a blue card because that has AOE damage. But uh, I mean, that's some technicalities we don't really have to worry about here. Brad using the main ability, trying to catch him in the sidestep. Super patient play, something that I can't do because I have no patience at all. But these gentlemen are showing that they're able to play at a very high level. Tons of tackles going around, a little unfortunate for Brad. It looks like his deck is mainly blast oriented, which can be a bit of a pain when it comes to dealing with all the tackles. Not having the strike card when that comes is probably the most frustrating thing. Bulma getting incinerated and sent to the heavens for sure. Jiren, is he gonna use that ult? Oh, thinking that he caught, oh no. And it looks like that's that might be game. Jiren's ultimate is definitely no slouch. Yeah, that looks like it might be game in fantastic yet random Jiren fashion. An overwhelming, crazy energy ball of death. The second, I mean, it's like the tournament of power. No, the second I did that second jump with Scout of Vegeta, I was like, it's gonna rise and rush. <laughs> the second I well, did it, I was like, bro. Well, gentlemen, those were some really good plays. A lot of you guys started to feel out each other's opponent. You guys are starting to figure out your everyone's timings, more patient play. Brad, I noticed you quickly caught on to ZVG. Being patient, waiting for you to make the side steps, you adjusted your timing. When did you realize you had to be a little bit more patient to get on, uh, I guess, CVGs, get off of the CVG train here? Well, the thing that, okay, so where you get me every, and this happened in the previous ones too, we had the messed up recording. And like, that's where you can tell CVG is like a pro pro player. It's the second he swaps in and clicks that green card to mess the timing up. And it gets me every single time because I'll sit there and wait and wait. And right as I got swipe, he swapped and hit the green card. And I'm like, nice. All right. Yep. Freeze time, I'm in the middle of this now. <laughs> so every single time. But easily one of the strongest mechanics in the game stopping time. And as you may have oh, heard yeah. at ZVG, Brad giving you huge applause huge applause on I that. Is that right? I, honestly, Brad caught me like five times and I'm like, bro, I got I got I gotta switch it up now. He, he's getting he's getting me too much on that. Well too my two much actually I gotta if give you Red. I apologize. If if you had a better team, it would have been Detrimental to me. It was yeah, my rising was... rushes, dude. I rise and rush that Frieza when I should have rise and rushed Jiren. He was the real threat. Well, honestly, I thought, I thought your choice for the Frieza wasn't too bad just because you completely took away the damage and key recovery passive, which was a big deal for those two because they were going to do quite a bit of yeah. damage with Frieza there. So, you know, it wasn't the worst choice. Actually, I agreed with it. I thought that was a pretty smart play to do. I'm so glad I, I actually landed in my rising rush. I was like, dude, I have to take this chance right here, right now. So I popped the green card and I was like, okay, wait two more seconds. Just just, just two more seconds. And then he said, I was like, yes, sir. I got yeah. you caught up. I got you caught up trying to make you drop your cards with Kale. I got way too caught yeah. up trying to do that. I was just hoping if he does one more combo, I'll make him drop all his cards. And then the second I jumped, I was like, he has a rising rush, Brad. What are you doing? <laughs> like, <laughs> it's all right. Though. Overall, it was fun, though. though. It was good, though. Overall, yeah, great funny. matches, really great matches. I really enjoyed commentating this. Gentlemen, any final words before we wrap this up? I love you, ZVG. No, 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 I love you too, man. <laughs> there you go, bro, GG. There you go, there you got it. Some good sportsmanship. So that's gonna be the end of the match. ZVG taking this one. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, maybe comment on what your favorite moment was for this match. And don't forget to check out the other matches and look forward to the ones coming in the near future. From everyone here at 5.9, Peace. Deuces. Peace.